economical recycling of films with a high proportion of contaminants, for example, agricultural films. The Hebel Shredder HGM was specially developed to deal with this problem. It can be operated wet, which substantially increases the service life of the cutters as compared to dry shredders. As the edges of the cuts don't bond together, cleaning in subsequent process stages is far more effective. As soon as it arrives in the shredder, the material to be processed is thoroughly wetted, thus making effective separation of dirt possible even at the beginning of the processing line. The shredded material is transferred via conveyors or washing screws to the VWE602 pre-wash unit. In the first chamber, the material is separated from heavy foreign bodies such as stones and metal. In the second chamber, two conveyor screws transport the film over a perforated floor plate. A series of spray nozzles loosens and removes superficial dirt. The third chamber separates out further sediments, which are detached while they're in the pre-wash unit. The shredded film is then fed from the pre-wash unit either directly or via a friction washer with simultaneous water exchange. In the wet granulator, the film is further granulated to the required flake size. With simultaneous addition of water, the friction in the granulating chamber ensures that the contaminated flakes are efficiently washed. The upstream process chain protects the cutters in the wet granulator from foreign bodies. In the high-power friction washer, paper is shredded and residual dirt is removed with the wastewater. In an intensive washer, the material is mixed with water by a special pump. Then it's fed with high acceleration to the hydrocyclone, where it's separated thoroughly from foreign plastic matter and residual contamination. With a degree of efficiency that a float sink separating tank, for example, can never achieve. Afterwards, the flakes are dried in several stages. First mechanically by centrifugal force, with two dryers mounted in series. And if necessary by a downstream thermal drying stage, heated with gas or electricity. The end product from the Herbolt washing line? Cleaned, contaminant-free film flakes, which can be fed directly to an extrusion or agglomeration process. The Herbolt washing line concept is based on decades of experience with special problem materials of this kind. The process is mature and a large number of these lines are already in use. Herbolt Meckersheim, recycling technology.